Okay, so here we have question number 19 from um, October, November 2011. We have um, paper 2, variant 3. This question is about the sector or the segment of a circle. So the diagram shows a sector AOB. A sector is like the shape of a pizza slice. Okay. That's a sector shape, the sector of a circle. So that's the sector. Um, the center O radius 9 centimeters. Okay. Angle AOB is 50. Let me move that over here. Okay. So this is A. This is, sorry, this is O. This is A. This is B. Okay. This is 50 degrees. This is a sector. Okay. 9 centimeters, 9 centimeters. Okay. Calculate the area of the segment shaded in the diagram. Now, segment is formed when you draw a chord. Okay, so like the, the point A and B are joined together with this arc in the sector, and they're joined together with this chord, which is a straight line, in this um, segment. The segment is like, you can think of the, the crust of the pizza, right? Drawn, it's cut from A to B. So this is like this section here, which is formed by the straight line, or the, the area between the straight line joining the point A and B and the, the arc joining A and B. So if I find the area of the whole sector and subtract from it the area of this triangle OAB, I'll be left with the area of the segment. Okay, so I'm going to take the area of that sector and I've got to subtract from it the area of this triangle, which is the triangle A, OAB. And again, this angle is 50 degrees and this is 9 and this is 9. Okay, so now what we know or what you should know is that the area of a the area of a sector okay, the area of a sector is given by now, if you think about it it's like it's a fraction of the area of the whole circle Okay, so it's going to have something to do with the formula for the area of a circle, which is pi r squared. But it's not the whole area of the circle, it's a certain fraction. And now the fraction of the area that this is of the whole circle is the same fraction that this angle makes with 360 degrees. So it's like 50 over 360 times pi r squared. So 50 over 360 times pi r squared. So the area of a sector is basically the angle theta over 360 times pi r squared. So for this it will be... 50 over 360 times pi times 9 squared. That will be the area of this sector. Okay, let me just write this here a bit neater. This is give you the formula for it. So the area, okay, of a sector is going to be the, the angle over 360 times pi times r squared. So whatever angle it is here, that's the angle that goes up there. And you're going to take away from that the area of this triangle. Now, the area of this triangle can be found very easily okay, by a certain um, formula, a half A, B, sine C. Okay, this is the formula that you learn in trigonometry when you have a triangle and you don't have its vertical height. Okay, so instead of having to go through the bother of finding the vertical height, this formula basically does it automatically. So A and B must be the two sides that, form, that make the angle. Okay, or that form the angle. Well, the angle must be between those two sides. I can't say 9 times this length times sine of 50. It has to be 9 times 9 times sine of 50 because 9 and 9 are the two sides that form the angle. Okay, the angle is between those two sides. So if I do the area of this sector minus the area of the triangle, which is a half times 9 times 9, which is like 9 squared, times the sine of the angle 50, then I should get the area of the triangle of the sec segment sorry okay so what we're going to do is we're going to do uh, 50 over 360 let's do it in one step 50 divided by 360 okay times oops that should be up here um, times pi times 9 squared which is 81 minus and then I'm going to put um, a half okay I can just just keep it as a fraction a half time up there sorry a half times 9 times 9 which is 81 again okay times the sine of 50 degrees now make sure that this is in degree mode which it is and that should give me my final answer okay which is 4 point so 
the area is going to equal 4.318 continuing on we need to round to 3SF so that gives you 4.32 centimeters squared so we found the area of the whole sector which is like the pizza slice minus the area of this triangle shape and you're left with the area of the segment okay i hope that was quite clear to you okay thank you for watching